What's up everybody, Atua here with Crypto Jumpstart and today I'm gonna to be going through my first experience of buying an NFT. I've never done gone to this before so I figured it'd be fun to record it and share it with you guys and just see how long it takes me to kind of get through the process with no prior experience of going through the steps. I'm hoping it's gonna be fairly simple and straightforward and that's what we're about to find out. Let's hop into the computer. Okay, so today I'm gonna to be using OpenSea.io which is one of the, the bigger platforms where um, NFTs are being traded and sold. So as you can see, the largest NFT marketplace, they have quite a few different categories for different NFTs. And I was on here a minute ago and I found this one that I thought was just kind of kind of funny and neat. And it was called NF Toucan or NF Toucans. So there's quite a few different Toucans being sold in NFTs and they're kind of numbered. I'm gonna go with this one since it's, I don't see any other ones that look like that. So before you go through with it, um, you're gonna wanna make sure you have a MetaMask set up in your browser as an extension. So I have my MetaMask wallet set up right here. And if you don't have one set up yet, I have a tutorial on how to do that. I'll leave the link in the description. So you're gonna wanna have some ETH in there also. If you don't have any ETH, you can buy some over at Coinbase, link in the description as well. And this NFT is going for $35, which I'm kind of debating if this image is worth $35, but it's my first NFT. And for the sake of this video, we're gonna get it because it is kind of neat. I'm just gonna click buy now. So here we go, sign into your wallet. So you can use different wallets. There are a few other ones, but it seems MetaMask is the most, probably the most well, well, most well used and most common. So I'd recommend going with that. So I make sure it's selected on my account, which has some ETH. I'm gonna click next. Uh, view the address of your permitted accounts. Uh, yes. So it's connecting up. Give that a minute. Um, I seem to be back at the same page. I'm not sure if I have to click buy now again. That would be kind of strange. That seems like the only uh, logical thing to do. Let's just see what happens. Okay, so here we go. Uh, it does say this item has not been reviewed by OpenSea. You should proceed with extra caution. Anyone create, create a digital item, include fake versions. Okay, um, so you know, I wouldn't be, if I was buying a substantial, a very expensive NFT, I would not probably not be getting it if it said this. But you know, it's a within reason of price. So by checking this box, I agree. Yes, I agree to that. I'm gonna check out to purchase this item for zero for 0 0.02 ETH. Complete this final transaction. So here we go, the transaction. Whoa! The price of this NFT has gone up quite a bit after all the fees and stuff is added in. Okay, so once you add the gas fee, it goes up to $43. And once you add, I guess the total amount in the end is $75. That must, have, must that also includes the transaction fee. But I'm gonna go ahead with it because it's just kind of this experience of buying a first NFT and sharing this with you guys. Um, so I'm gonna go with it. Uh, there we go, the transaction has started. The Ethereum network is processing your transaction, which can take a little while. Let's hope everything goes through smoothly. This is definitely the most expensive toucan image I've ever bought. I've never actually bought a toucan image, so this is the only toucan image I've ever bought. There we go, the transaction has succeeded. I'm gonna head back to all items. Okay, so I just clicked over to my profile, and then here I can see my NFT, my NF2 can number 19, which is kind of neat. I'm 19 years old. And then I can also see over here my dot crypto domains, which I have from Unstoppable Domains. And if you're curious in those, those it's another type of NFT. It's kind of the what is probably gonna be the future of decentralized domains. So domains instead of dot com, they're dot crypto. I have a full tutorial on that. Can check that out in the description but hope you enjoyed following along this is my first ever nft 
and I think I'll do another tutorial on um, a few another marketplace. But that's a wrap for this one. Hope you enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe and Crypto Jumpstart jumping out.